Hey, what's up you guys? It's your girl Kalima and we are here at BET Her. It is all about women in entertainment, empowering each other. And you already know what it is. It's all Urban Central. Let's go. What's up, you guys? I am here with the Mona Scott Young. How are you feeling? I'm feeling great. How are you? I'm feeling wonderful now that I can finally speak to a boss, a real boss. Yes, yes, yes. So, I mean, you're obviously known for being the head of an incredibly huge franchise. If nothing else, Cardi B will forever, you know, be one of those. Her, you know, her, her song gave you a shout out. It did, it did, except she didn't get the young part of my name. Yes, no, exactly, no. but no. We all know who it was. We are yeah. so proud of Cardi. She's yeah. doing amazingly, yes. Yeah. Is she your most, you know, proud? You know, even though it's not all, it wasn't all you that oh created God. her, yeah. but is that like, for you, was that a proud moment in your career? Of course it's a proud moment. It's a proud moment for me whenever I see any of the cast. You know, what I call go forth and prosper. That's the point of this. Yeah. I say to them all the time, you guys didn't get into this to be reality stars. Yeah. You got into this to have a platform, yeah. to showcase, you know, your art form, to showcase your lives in a way that hopefully helps you catapult into whatever it is you want to do. So I love it when I see that their focus is there and they're able to really utilize the platform to get to where they're trying to go. Cardi's a great example of that. K. Michelle is a great example of that. You know, oh my God, Stevie J seeing him enjoy and be musical again is a great example of that. So I think the platform does its thing. Did you know it was going to be this big when it first kind of came? I don't think anyone knew. You know, what we knew is that we had a world that people hadn't seen, yeah. but I don't think anyone anticipated that it was going to connect so completely with the audience. And there's so much controversy on the brand itself, you know, and people, of course, blame you because you are the the face that, you know, we see, but there's so many different pieces. Being in entertainment, you learn that there is a huge team to make things happen. What's something that people don't know about you? Um, I, I don't know. I'm a pretty transparent person. I mean, I'm just somebody who is trying to live their best life, right? And in the process, if I can give anyone else an opportunity to live their best life, it's what I do. For years I managed and, you know, moving into television was an incredible blessing because it afforded me an opportunity to give opportunities to other people. So I enjoy doing that. But it's also afforded me the opportunity to continue to grow my brand and my business. You know, I have my Moscato Mixed Fusions that I partnered with Nikki on. I've got now the book Blurred Lines that we are, you know, launching now. I've got a new platform, Mona Me Direct. I've got a clothing collection called Matsi Bella. So, so many things that I've been able to do based on the audience and the support that I've garnered from doing Love and Hip Hop that it's hard to say that it's been anything but a blessing for both me and all of the cast members. And, and that's amazing. You know, we see, we only see one side, but it sure. takes a woman boss. Only a woman can be so multi, you know, talented, putting your hand in, in several different pots. What's the hardest thing about being a woman boss? Um, I think finding the balance, right? We have nurturing spirits by nature. That's who we are as women. I've got two children. I've got a husband. I've got a family. So finding that balance in time and then finding time for myself. That's something that we tend to put on the back burner. So that's something I'm constantly striving for, finding that balance. And it's something that I encourage because what I've learned the hard way is that if you don't pour back into yourself, you have nothing left to give to anything else. So you've got to take care of you so you can take care of everybody yeah, else. Yeah, yeah. And you, yeah. Don't, you can be a millionaire or a hundred, you yeah. know, dollars in your pocket and see that. Yeah. Right, exactly. And, that. and and it's all the same no matter who yeah. you are and at what level you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those tenants are still the same. Take care of yourself, you know, be good to yourself yeah. and follow your dreams. Push, push, push through. Yes, yes. Push, yes. All, the push all the way through. Mona Scott Young, y'all, this is all Urban Central.